When I went to a design camp a couple years ago, I found out something about creativity that changed everything. It was Jake Parker's concept of creative bank account. I will have a link to his original video at the end and in the description. I found out that ability to create is not an endless resource. It's not a talent, it's a material that you need to replenish and then use. It's better to imagine it as something physical. Then it's easy to understand why you can't just get new ideas over and over again without refilling it. Sometimes when I wake up, I open art accounts and after 20 minutes of scrolling, I want to draw so bad. That is because I just refilled my creativity. But this is an example of a short-term refillment. It is more important to fill your creative bank account for long-term use. If you constantly fill it, desire to draw and ideas will also be pretty constant. And vice versa, empty creative bank account is sometimes the reason for art blocks. Personally, mine happen exactly for this reason. Because I keep squeezing ideas out of an empty creative bank account. There is a cool book called Still Like an Artist by Austin Kleon. In the first chapter, Austin explains why we all need to do it. In other words, why we all need to fill our creative bank accounts. He says that we should save everything that can turn out useful, everything we like, to something he calls a swipe file, which is basically a folder with everything that inspires us. It can be digital or physical, doesn't matter. And when you need inspiration and ideas, the swipe file will help. This is a perfect way to always have something to fill your creativity with. I like to have different folders for different things. For example, I need to draw an old man. I have no idea how to do this. But I have a folder with a couple of art references saved in an old people folder. And now I have inspiration and ideas. Or I need to come up with a pose for a character. Nice! I have a folder called poses. It has all the cool poses that I liked, but can't remember anymore. Besides from saving pictures, there are other ways to fill up your creativity bank account. It totally happens through other people's art. When we watch movies, read books and comics that inspire us. And it also happens when life inspires us, through our experiences. I personally feel like my creativity is being filled when I travel, see new interesting people that I want to draw or even when I look at a sunset. An interesting thing that I realized recently that the more love I have for something, the more I want to draw it. The more I love a movie, the more I want to redraw screenshots from it. And if I have love for all the people in my life and life in general, I want to draw all the time, everyone, everything. Love is the answer for everything. <laughs> so if you want to always have a full creative bank account, surround yourself with people that inspire you and art that inspires you. Instead of scrolling through memes and news, scroll through art. Leave the house after all, just to observe nature and people. Travel doesn't necessarily mean somewhere far, just somewhere new. Feeding your creativity is easy. You just need to find something or someone that inspire you and feed from it. It will save you from many art blocks. Or if you're struggling with one right now, refilling your creativity might help to get you out of it. Even 20 minutes of good art can help. I promise you, if your life is full of colors, your art will be also. So keep looking up good art, draw, and don't slouch.